The sterilization cycle typically lasts about 8 to 10 hours. It can be divided in three phases. Product conditioning, sterilization, aeration. Let's focus on the sterilization step. After preconditioning, where products are heated and humidified, pallets are transferred into the sterilizer. Once the sterilizer door is closed, a vacuum is pulled to evacuate the air in the chamber. The tightness of the vessel is checked by a leak test, and if proven safe, a first nitrogen injection is made to ensure a non-flammable gas mixture. Another vacuum is pulled before steam can be introduced into the chamber to heat and humidify the products again. Ethylene oxide can now be injected in the chamber. Liquid EO runs from the bottle to the vaporizer where it is heated, changed into gaseous form and finally injected in the chamber. During exposure time, EO penetrates cartons, blisters and bags, even through products' membranes. EO has this ability to reach the most challenging part of a device. At the end of the exposure time, a series of flushes evacuate the gas mixture, which is sent to a gas treatment system like a catalytic oxidizer. An ultimate air inlet brings the chamber back to atmospheric pressure. And if all safety checks are satisfactory, the control system authorizes the unloading door to open. Pallets are finally transferred to an aeration room where they can further desorb.